How much of a challenge is it playing a quarterback with, you know, eight years of college experience like both Nailers? Uh, it's a big challenge. Can't underestimate him. He's played a lot of ball, got a lot of experience, you know. Uh, you know, his, his play style, you know, you, you think you know it. You think you got a little tip on him here and there. But at the end of the day, uh, I mean, we had to respect him. And I feel like I feel like we did in a way. And then, you know, we started to get a little bit more comfortable realizing what was going on, kind of with their game plan on, what, you know, what he had his eye on and such. But uh, all respect to him. But uh, it's, yeah, it's definitely not easy. Jory, what is the difference with this defense when the – Game is on the line late, and you know they had had momentum in that second half. What enabled you guys to really step up and make two big plays on fourth down? I was funny, but I was thinking about this upstairs. Uh, Coach Vick has said it too. Uh, sadly, <laughs> I think that's when we're best is when our backs are against the wall. And but that's also something very dangerous because I mean, if we can learn to put it all together, play complimentary ball, it's a wrap. So, but uh, <clears throat> I mean, you know, he makes that uh. Uh, Aylers made a great play. Who was that? Uh, was that third? Third down, I think. Fourth. 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 Yeah. Fourth. I'm not going to lie. I was sick to my stomach. Schwartz, knee was down. Uh, came right off Hughes, fingertip. And dude was like a half a yard past the marker. Uh, it's a sickening feeling, but I mean, at the end of the day, you, that's, that's, that's the game. You got you to gotta get used to it, be able to move on. Uh, some guys, some teams might not be able to handle that. You know, they start to break down, blame one another, such and such. I mean, we years of experience for myself. I mean, I, I know how to move on. I've been trying to lead these guys and show by example. You know, next play, simple as that. Great play by them. But I mean, we were able to do what we needed to do to get it done. What was your perspective on uh, fourth and one? There was the penalty in the huddle. I did did you have any view on like what happened? Oh, the one on the far end by the student section? Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, I was thinking about that too as well, man. Uh, it's, you know, teams think they got us rattled and such. You know, I feel like a lot of teams like to do that with us because, you know, we're a very emotional team. We are. But we're emotional in all the right ways. It's just sometimes, you know, it's an emotional game. You can, things can get out of hand. Things happen. But uh, at the end of the day, when it comes down to it, like I said, when it comes time, we were able to lock back in and handle business like we're supposed to. When it gets chippy like that, do you feel like that benefits your guys' defense? Of course, you know, we don't want to teach that and, you know, show that that's the right way and such. But, uh, <clears throat> I mean, I just, man, I, I, I'm kind of lost for it. But, I mean, we somehow, some way, we've always found a way to snap back in and get the job done, ultimately, when we go back out there on the field, whether we're chipping on the sideline, <clears throat> chipping out on the field, for the play start or whatever, at the end of the day, we know how to we know how to get it done. How was it to see Solace, Joel, Dez here tonight to kind of see you guys in action? <laughs> it's kind of funny. I mean, they put Solace and Dez's name uh, so many times up there. I thought they was coming in the lineup for a second. <laughs> 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 I'm like, God dang, it's, uh, we, we had just came off uh, three and out, and they talking about Desmond Ritter. I'm like, I'm like oh, yeah, Brett, Brett Bingo. <laughs> but, but nah, man, it's good to see those guys. Love them all. I was upstairs talking to Joel for a little while, catching up, and you know, I hope to do the same with all the other guys who uh, you know come throughout the weeks and or throughout the days, you know. But uh, it's always good seeing those guys. You know, that's that's what we're trying to create here is family. You know, guys feel comfortable being able to come back home. You know, catch a game. So say what's up to the dudes and go handle business. Defense was on the field in the first quarter, 11 minutes total after the safety, and then uh, after that, they really started. You guys really started to settle in. Did you guys make any adjustments there to get? Those three now to get those big stops? Yeah, of course. You know, we uh yeah, the defense you gotta be able to realize, you know, when the the offense might be moving a little slow, we're trying to put things together real quick and you know that's that's part of playing ball and playing complimentary ball is being able to hold it down for the <coughs> hold it down for the offense and such. That's that's defense, man. It happens, that's ball. But uh, you know, it wasn't rattled, it wasn't shook. At the end of the day, I mean it's a cold game. Shoot, I kinda wanted to be out there a little longer, not gonna lie to you. But uh but yeah, man, that's one more for Jabari. Did you notice anything different about the VCU run game with Keaton Mitchell about not to have contact? Uh, that was the target call, wasn't it? Yeah. Uh, <clears throat> not too much. I mean, he's a dude who likes, you know, he's beeline to the sideline, so, you know, you got to respect your speed and all. Uh, but 
and, and I mean, if we were still respecting the run game, you know, we think we still got to stop the run just because he's out. Doesn't mean nothing, no, bro. Still the same old line, still the same QB back there. You know, I had a couple mishaps. Uh, that one we was down on the one yard line, and it got a little antsy. Took the uh, took too shallow of a step, you could say, I guess, or too long of a step. Should have been closer to the line, but uh, but yeah, no, no, no difference for real. Just the same respect for him. He's got to stop the run. Well, thanks, Jabari. Yep. Thanks, Jabari.